Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we got something different. We're starting a new series. We, as you see behind me, I got a Mark IV Supra. Uh, this car is special. Um, we're gonna introduce uh, the person right now. We got Edwin with me, the owner of this car. What's up Edwin, how you doing? Hey, how you doing guys? Um, so introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Edwin Mayorga. I own this car, the Toyota Supra Mark IV. I purchased the car back in 2005. And uh, it was my dream car for like probably like five years at least. And I was chasing, trying to buy, and then, they, and, and then after a little while, I was able to buy. So, um, talk more about the car. What, uh, you said what year it was? So the car is in 1995. 1995. Yeah, so it inspired me to do the, uh, the way it is, because you guys already know, because of the movie Fast and the Furious, you know? And basically, I did, you know, a couple modifications, you know, through all the years, you know. And uh, basically, I didn't want to do exactly replica, so I just want to do a tribute card. And uh, as you can see, there's a lot of modifications different from the replica. Uh, so, another question, what made you get into cars? That's a good question. That's a good question. <laughs> That's a tough question. Uh, basically... Through uh through our movies basically through movies yeah so was... you just watching movies you like you like you like to watching cars uh got you excited like you you just wanted to like you had the feeling like oh yeah I want I want I want to drive cars like I want to drive sports supercars Ex exactly so that's what exactly then previously I had the Mark Four a Mark Three Supra previously I had it for seven years so I'm really a Toyota guy as you can see yeah that was a question I was gonna lead into actually uh what made you buy the car. Uh, like I say, that car, after I saw the movie, you know, you know, I fell in love with that movie and especially this car and it was chasing, yeah. you know, for years and finally I got my dream country. It still is my dream. Yeah. <laughs> so how long you had the car for? So I bought the car back in 2005. 2005? So 18 years. How ago. much was it when you bought it? Okay. So you, you, you guys got to get ready for this one, all right? So I purchased a car for eleven thousand dollars. Eleven thousand dollars. Eleven thousand dollars. There's yep. no damn way. That was a gift. That, that was a gift. You eleven thousand dollars for this. Yes. Yes. Wow. I was lucky. I was one of the lucky ones. How much is it right now? Like. Uh, I don't want to sound tacky, but I already got offered for one fifty. One fifty. And and me and my wife we were talking about it. And we were like, nah. Yeah, you, money, can, you, cannot, you cannot get over this yeah, car. Yeah, money is not everything in life. So this is our joy. This is our, our therapy. Yeah. As you can see every day, you know, when we're able to, to buy the car. How many miles you got on it? Okay, right now I have 115. And when I bought it back in 2005, it had 89,000 miles. So that's the original motor of the car? No, it was swapped. It was swapped. It was okay. Swapped, yeah. So when you got it, you said you had 85? 89. 89. 89,000. No, you, you actually you actually drive it. I see. I, I, you, how long has I mean, it been? Eighteen like, years. Eighteen years. No, no, no he doesn't. Drive he doesn't it. drive it. He doesn't <laughs> drive it. Let's get to the fun part now. What mods you got on the car? All right. So we got Rohana wheels, nineteen inches, as you can see. Uh, we got the bell size side skirt. Uh, we put uh, the rear diffuser. And that's custom rear diffuser, right? Yeah, custom. As you can see, different spoiler, yeah, NRG, NRG, right? And uh, Nas is coming though. <laughs> I'm tricking people no. with that. It doesn't have Nas yet. Yeah. And it's definitely a manual transmission, right? Yeah. Manual six speed. Six speed. What made you get the left hand drive? You were able to get a right hand drive. Uh, you know what? And I, I, I never was interested to buy a, a right hand drive. Yeah. You know, because and I left it number one. And, yeah. <laughs> and for me, it's difficult. Yeah. And uh, what you got under the hood? So, pop the hood, pop the hood. Hey, pop the hood. Pop the hood? Pop the hood. Basically, we have the 2JC BVTI engine. Uh, it's pushing 650 to the wheel. We have Bow Warner 362, as you can see. Yeah. Big ejectors. And uh, what else? And uh, actually, bigger uh, fuel pump system mm -hmm. in it. And a couple carbon fibers here. Not a couple. I see. I see a bunch of carbon fiber right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here and there. Um, but yeah, like, how much are you pushing? Uh, right now I'm pushing 650 to the wheel. 
650 to the wheel. Yeah, but my goal is going to be 800. So you stopping at 800 or you got to keep going? Uh, 800 out of 800. Yeah, yeah, I, I think, think that's, I think that's, that's pretty good for... Like, that's all you need. You don't, you don't even need more than 500, in my no. opinion, on the street, but... You don't use it. Yeah. So what's the favorite thing about the car? So my favorite part is basically the love that people, every time we cruise by or we stop by, and they show us. They respect the work that we put into the car. Yeah. You know, the time. And, and people appreciate that. And it's I'm, a showstopper, huh? Yeah, it's a showstopper. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, exactly. People, you know, respect that. What's your favorite mod about the car? Uh, that I would say the 650. The wheel. 650 wheel. Oh, the yeah. power it, it has. It's fun. Yeah, it it's goes. Fun, yeah. yes. uh, what was the thing that you hate about the car? Uh, well, right now, guys, stage, uh, it takes three clutch. And I, <laughs> I hate that part, though. You yeah. know, I'm going to change that. It's tough. Soon. It's tough to handle, right? Oh, yeah. It's... Not what many got, people can drive the car. Yeah, I remember I, when I just like when I tried to drive it the first time and I stalled. Right, it was it was a little bit embarrassing, but he told me that I don't even need to use gas and that's just let off the, the clutch a little bit and it starts moving by itself. So, yeah, would you ever trade this car? Honestly, I, I'm not. I no, would, I will not. I will not do that. So, say if you do trade it, what would be the car that you trade it to? Uh, I would say uh, the M3. M3? Yeah, Vietnam, the new one, the, the G80? The, the G80, G80, yeah. I would, I would say that that's, one. That's what I'm going for yeah, next yeah. year. Next year. <laughs> Stay tuned for that, though. I'm, I'm, I'm going to oh, get yeah. there. Um, okay. So, what? Beamers, Stay tuned. So he's right. trying, I'm yeah, see? Play. The, 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 more, the more people I hang around with, the more they, they want to be in the, the, like, the German, uh, <laughs> German cars. <laughs> so, it's... it's <laughs> <laughs> Remember how you said to you anyway, so I'm turning everyone into a beamer. Soon, soon. Yes. <laughs> what would you be your dream garage? If you can have five cars in your garage, what would they be? Okay, uh the second one would be the R34. R34. The uh third one is gonna be the M3. Okay. Uh the fourth is gonna be Sylvia, Nissan Sylvia. He's going all small cars, he doesn't yep. want any big cars. Yeah, in the uh in the R35. R35. Yeah. So it's all JDM except the uh, M3, basically. So you're a JDM guy. I see. Yeah. Um, Can you tell, right? <laughs> <laughs> if you have any Instagram, any uh, social media platforms you want to shout out. So I use. Uh, can you guys please follow SupraZone1995? That's my Instagram and also the TikTok. Same things. Uh, SupraZone1995. I appreciate your support.